Before we get into the video, people, I am giving away 11,500 Apex coins. To be with a chance of winning them, make sure you subscribe to the channel and have that bell notification button ticked. Drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. More details are in that video description. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today, I bring you another Apex Legends video. And today, I want to go through all we know about the Battle Pass, including price, what comes with its release, rewards and more, as well as what's coming with Season 1. Okay, so firstly, when's this thing being released? So over the past few days, we have seen many leaks, rumours, mishaps by EA, Origin, Respawn and so forth, stating that it would be released on the 12th of March, but that date has gone. The only other date we have seen was data mined a while back which suggested the 25th of March, which is what I've always believed. And today within this video, this is the only information we ain't sure on, the damn release date for the Battle Pass. But like I said, 25th of March people, mark your calendar, that's when I truly believe it will drop. Now yesterday I speculated that maybe the Battle Pass was supposed to come out on the 12th of March, but because, uh, well due to a recent exploit, maybe it was postponed, this exploit allowed people on PC to actually get three Apex coins, a thousand in total. Now I ain't gonna show you how you do this, I ain't gonna link you to a video which shows you how to do this because the reports are coming in that people are getting banned for doing this and I don't want that for you guys. Plus it's a thousand Apex coins, I mean, it ain't even worth it. Now there is a little bit of evidence which corresponds with this as well. A Twitch streamer was opening Apex packs and he got an error message pop up on his screen which told him he'd received something that wasn't in the game yet and this happened on the 12th of March. So maybe it was supposed to be patched in on the 12th of March but they postponed that patch which would have been for the Battle Pass in Season 1 and that's why he got this error message pop up on his screen. Now you can see images on screen of that now but if you want to check out the full Twitch clip you'll find it linked within the video description. So maybe, just maybe people, it was supposed to drop on the 12th of March, but they've postponed it due to one reason or another. We do not know. So let's move on. So the Battle Pass itself, will there only be a paid version? Or will there be a version you can play and unlock things for free? Data might suggest that might be the case. But an image dropped yesterday by mistake talks about a Battle Pass and its price of 950 Apex coins. It states, welcome to the wild frontier, survive the arena, meet the Apex Games' latest legend, Octane, wield new weapons and score unique loot. The Season 1 Battle Pass is here, purchase it at the in-game store for 950 Apex coins. So the price will be around $10 or £8 if you live in the UK, which you can purchase 1000 Apex coins for. But will there be a free version of it? Now we saw data mined files which suggested there would be a free version, but I just ain't sure about that. I mean, we see games like Fortnite who, when they do drop battle passes, they do have a free version too, which you can play along with and still score unique loot. But whether or not Respawn do that, we do not know yet. I mean, if they were to do it, they probably wouldn't want to announce it because obviously they want everybody to buy and purchase the battle pass, but we will see people over the coming weeks. Now the Battle Pass will be hold more than likely unique items like weapon skins, character skins, quips, banners, frames and more. Hopefully rewards unique to the Battle Pass that won't come from Apex packs. But we will see on that. People are speculating that Octane, who we know will come at the same time as the Battle Pass and Season 1, will be a reward from the Battle Pass. I couldn't disagree more. Respawn have confirmed many a times that all Legends will be available to purchase directly from the store. So yeah guys, I guarantee Octane will not be tied to the Battle Pass, but will come alongside it. Octane, who we all know is a guy called Octavia Silva, a stuntman daredevil who was paralysed. Now rebuilt and half robotic, he comes into the fold with Season 1. I also believe we will see the All-Star EMG as well as soon as Season 1 and the Battle Pass starts. Now yesterday, with all the promotional Battle Pass images we saw drop, we also got new images of the All-Star in-game, which you can see on the screen now. This is a weapon I 100% believe we will see with the start of the Season 1. Again, nothing tied to that Battle Pass. Now, something else we saw data mined which ties into the Battle Pass and that it seems to have its own lobby. Now, I made a comment on this on a past video and believe maybe Battle Pass holders will get access to an exclusive mold. I mean, it makes sense with the amount of data mine mods we have seen and it's a good way for Respawn to entice players into buying the Battle Pass, the paid version anyway. Respawn, it seems, are working really hard on making the Battle Pass special. It's hard to think what it can offer, but the possibilities are endless. 
I know due to other data my files that there will be a diamond level associated with the battle pass. And whether or not this will be the top level, I don't know, but it sounds cool. I think there will possibly be tiers to this battle pass and not actual numbered levels. So instead of having levels like 1 to 100, which we have now, there will be things like tiers like bronze level 1 to 10, then silver level 1 to 10, then gold level 1 to 10, and then all the way up to a diamond, which I do like the sound of. And seeing a diamond level data mined from the battle pass, it leads one to believe this. I also don't think the battle pass will be anything short. So many people got to that level 100 relatively quick. And considering the next season, which uh, will be season 2, won't be here till June, maybe the end of June, I think they will want this content to last quite some time. So let's definitely hope that's the case anyway. I love chasing things, that's for sure. And when you're getting rewarded for these things, it's even better. But yeah guys, this is what we know about season 1, what's coming, the battle pass, with a few added bits of speculation on my behalf. And on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a like, it really does help out. Go on new around here and enjoy daily Apex Legend videos like guides, top 5 gameplay reviews, just about everything. Make sure you subscribe and if you never want to miss a video upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.